family of Molly Bish is still pressing for answers. The teen was kidnapped while working as a lifeguard. As our Frank Holland reports, there are new reasons for new hope. We were wondering if he could help us. Making calls, hoping to find information that will lead to the killer of Molly Bish on the somber 15 year anniversary of her disappearance. I can never forget that day. My sister was taken from her place of employment and left on the side of a mountain to never be found. Molly's older sister, private investigator Sarah Stein, and these volunteers working on what they call the Just One Car campaign at the Sturbridge Host Hotel. We're right. attempting to locate a vehicle that belongs to a person of interest in our case. Five investigates uncovered that vehicle is a 1986 white Buick LeSabre. It belonged to a man who was staying at a campground near Commons Pond in Warren. That's where 16 year old Molly was taken from. Investigators have questioned that man. We're going through all the auto parts shops, salvage yards, everything in New England and the surrounding areas and states. The tip about the car came from a similar event in October. These volunteers have the VIN number of the Buick and are using it to try and find the car. Every call we get a little step closer. They hope that car will provide key DNA evidence or at least rule out one possibility. Molly's sister says the family won't rest until they get justice. I want this person to be safely away from other people so they don't destroy another family, another child's life. The Bish family will hold a candlelight vigil in Molly's honor tomorrow. It will begin in Warrentown Common. They will then walk to Commons Pond, where she was abducted. Here in Sturbridge, Frank Holland, WCVB News Center 5.